Hi guys, round three, pretty good hand, I'm on the draw, my opponent put me on the draw, and yeah, not much more to discuss, I would not like to mulligan, he kept his seven as well, no mention of a split, so I guess his deck's good, but mine's good too, and my hand's pretty good, so we'll lead with a planes turn one, make sure I do that, something I always forget, although it's hard to forget when you have the actual card in your hand. I pretty much always make the wrong, wrong land turn one because I don't think about what's in my deck. Something to bear in mind if you've got a double white card in your deck and you've got Plains Mountain, then yeah, make the uh, make the, the Plains turn one if you have double white or the other way around if you have a double red. These little pro tips is what you're here for. Not that I'm a pro, but you know, I can still get pro tips. So do we walk into the old schlag storm here? Yeah, Ember Smith's not that good anyway. Who cares about schlag storm? It's not like he can have it, it's not like he's 3-0. This isn't a slag storm, this is. You're a Brask the Hidden. Yeah, that's pretty good. I mean, it's not great right now, but... It's, it's obviously a good card. I might two for one myself to burn it. Um, I could just hit him for nine. And then have him pretty much dead on board. I don't think I'm going to do that actually. Because then if he makes a guy, he'll go to four, and then I've got um, Arc Trail and Inquisitor Exarch. So yeah, he's basically dead here. Unlucky. Should have kept a better hand. <laughs> Just wanted to show me his mythic. Being a bit arrogant here, but I'm pretty sure I can't lose this game. Because even if that doesn't work, I'll just blister stick him the next turn. So, yeah. How about... No, I'll do that later. Get my one damage in. Obviously, he might have two removal spells, but then I'll just kill him with. I'll show him my arc trail. Leeching bite. Yeah, whatever. Uh, in fact. Um, I guess I might as well use this. Give it pro green. Why not, you know? No. We better go pro green, yes. Again, <laughs> it's just a case of which cards to show him. I think I'd rather he'd I'd rather he knew about Apostle's Blessing than he knew about Arc Trail. And I'm just gonna get him here. Can't bother to wait around. And a GG. Thanks for playing. Yeah, that was a pretty good draw. Can't run that good every game, but I mean, most of my deck is good. Like, none of my cards are bad, so... We are going to get that draw quite often, as we have been. As you may or may not have noticed, we do have a lot of removals, spells. He chose to play first again. This hand is ugh, not quite as good, but he mulligan, so yeah, I'll keep. I'll lead with a such a priest in case I draw a mountain for my Embersmith. Mountain one time. That's not a mountain. Mountain would have been really good there. Oh, he's attacking. He obviously doesn't care too much about his copper mirror. In which case, I will just play that Glint Hawk Idol and not gain a life off it. <laughs> My hand's pretty good if I draw mountains. Have we? Yeah, we've drawn red cards every game this, every turn this game, haven't we? Kept the old two red no mountain hand and then drew three straight red cards, but obviously I can't complain after my first turn draw. Wonder what he can find with it. 
Oh, no, I don't need to. Oh, this was an artifact. Gain some life back. Uh, yes, always yield. Always yield. Oh no, I chose it the wrong way around. Never mind. Um, then attack. Do I have any broken artifacts? I don't think I do, because I could steal his Cold Oath, the Forge Master, and then sack it. Do some cool stuff, but no, I don't think I do have artifacts. So, that plan will have to wait for another day. Um, if I arc trail him and this, and then get him for 5, put him on 10 keeps them off being able to just bring out a massively ridiculous artifact. Then you're gonna have active aggression if that is the case. But I think I might just be better off making a blade tribes. Yeah I'll just do that. I'll get him for two. And then yeah just make make a three three gain a life. No, doesn't want to make 3-3. Three, three. There we go. Just use my mana a bit more efficiently this way. Oh, I crushed my glint or guidel. How lucky. Eurobrask again. Yes, I would like to use this ability. Um... Four, five, six, seven. Yeah, I'll take it. So, what now? I mean, he can't really have that much else in his deck. Uh, well, in his hand, because he's only got one card. So I think if I leave a blocker black, let's say a block blocker black, a blocker back. So let's say such or priest, because gold mid doesn't count as a blocker, does it? No, enter the battlefield tapped. So I think what I'll do, I'll, I'll make this gold mid. and then I'll arc trail him for two and one. And it does, yeah, two and then one. So two and one. If he's got the leeching bite. If he's got the leeching bite, that means oh, he doesn't. I was gonna say that means. Um, in fact, if he does have the leeching bite, four, five, eight. He, he did think when I did that, which would suggest he has it. But let's put him on five, six. So if we're dealing five, put him on six. Then next turn he'll be dead to Eurobrask plus. Yeah, I think that's fine. Yeah, that works out fine. He needs to have Leeching Bite. Or he needs to have Removal and a Creature, and he only had one card in his hand at the start. Just that. I mean, if he had the kill, he'd be attacking with both, so he doesn't. So I think... Then again... Uh... Yeah, I'll block now. While I've still got the chance... Unnatural predation. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> so I guess if you drew a creature there, he'd actually won. If you drew a creature with power three or more, he'd won. Yeah, unlucky. Because now I'm just going to go... Still this. And kill you, hopefully. Yeah, he says GG. Fair enough. Cool. No complaints from him. My draw was pretty good. Didn't get a complaint, so decent guy. Nice eight packs. Thank you very much. And some watermarks that don't mean anything. And an act of aggression that might be able to sell to for half a tick. So, cool. Lost the first draft, but won the second one. So, oh, what's this? Fire, it's a metamorph. Yeah, thanks for watching. Um, 
I mean, didn't learn a whole lot from that draft because I just took fairly standard cards. In fact, no, I did like such a priest. He was really good in in my deck because I was I was racing a lot, and I did like Bloodseeker, and I still like such a priest. Um, his his gain life ability is not that relevant, especially in my deck where I'm laying out most of my guys early and before him. But yeah, the, 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 even if you lose them like two three life during the course of the game, that ability can be relevant and. Um, act of aggression is good and versatile as we already knew and into the core was really good for us in round two but overall a good draft obviously because I won thanks for watching and catch you next time My, maybe it's with some block games or some standard games maybe not a draft we'll have to see let me know in the comments which you'd rather see but it might have to be on, on cockatrice not on modo but the pictures are all there so it's roughly the same um, yeah cheers